Hey guys, this is Jeffrey again. Today we're gonna check this uh, big scanner. This is the OBD scanner. It's called the uh, KW850. So uh, this scanner looks very strong and it's really big one. And here we have a USB cable, USB port for the upgrade. And inside the packing, we see one user menu it's pretty thick yeah and have a USB cable for the PC upgrade and we have a CD inside with the software and need them back the packing and also it's coming with one of this very long diagnostic cable it's about five feet or six feet long directly connect this one to your diagnostic port and then connect to this scanner so it can read so that it can read the car without any problems so let's check the main interface this is the main interface it's looking really like our like a cell phone interface with this uh, very very precise icons so we have a diagnostic icon for the car diagnostic for the engine part and this is the DTC lookup so you can check whatever your 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 DTC it is it will show you with different car makes so here's how it works and it's coming with the review function so you can review all this data if you have and you also can delete it and from the tool setup you see this a uh, multi-language diagnosis scanner so you can see support Russian Portuguese Spanish let's check how is the interface looks like it looks like it's pretty nice I hope the the, the, the translation doing a little better so let's try to change it back. And we'll see here it's a two setup. And we'll have a data printable. So you can print all this data. So you need to connect this uh, PC this wire the USB cable to the PC and then you can print all this data and also inside this help you have some information like this what is this what is this RPM with detailed explanation where is the TP so all this uh, information you, you see inside the diagnostic life data and it's coming with another function for the battery check so it will con continuously monitor the battery voltage if you have a low battery it will pump you and ask you to change so we have a one key IM IM readiness hotkey just press this one it will go to the diagnostic it will go to the readiness status and showing in this graph mode and whatever when you let's check inside this diagnostic page so it's a full OBD function diagnostic scanner or you see this little question mark you just press here it will tell you what's this like and the first step you can read codes with this scanner and if there is so this car has no fault code. If there is, you can use this one to easily erase it. And then the IM readiness, same as this button. And also we will have uh, the model six and the model model nine, the data stream. So it allows you to read. You can view it. View the graph data 
like this current temperature with the RPM inside air take temperature so you see some the data is upgrade in real time so you can compare all this data what is the what is the, the updating and also you can also record it you can record on record them all and same as the DTC you can also record it and you can perform the you can view the freeze frame if you have in in your vehicle and I also can record it and print it so this is the oxygen sensor test it can it allows you to 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 read the sensors the oxygen sensors test results and this one we have a uh, onboard monitor for the comp and then for the evap leak system model 8 and at last you can check your vehicle information by the wing code and all this you can read by this KW850 powerful diagnosis scanner if you have any question just let me know